everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming another fun little styling haul for you guys but this time it's with Nasty Gal and I'm so excited because the theme is festivals. You guys know festivals are my jam. You guys know I love styling everything for festivals. It's like my little creative space when I get to dress for festivals. So this is a really, really fun haul for me to film. And I'm actually dying over the products that Nasty Gal have sent me. Like they are literally so me to a T. So I'm gonna style them all up for you guys. And then I'm gonna show you what they look like on. So I think for this vlog, I'm gonna run through each piece and then I'm going to show you guys how I have styled it. I've made it all, like I said, a festival theme so you guys are going to get lots of inspo for Splendor and all of this stuff I have a discount code for as well. I just wanted to let you guys know as well this video is sponsored by Nasty Gal but Nasty Gal have honestly been a brand that I have worked with for so so long and I've also shopped with Nasty Gal since I was literally 15 years old and working in an admin <laughs> position. As like literally when I was doing my uni degree in, in fashion so I've honestly been shopping at Nasty Gal for such a long time so this is such a little dream of mine to be able to work with them on such a fun video. So my discount code is EmilyD55 and I'm not even kidding you it gets you 55% off everything on the Nasty Gal site. If you guys want any of these pieces I'm gonna leave all the links in the description for you guys and you can literally go and purchase any of the stuff that I have in this vlog, but you can get 55% off with my code, which is wild. Especially if you guys are looking for last minute outfits for Splendor, because I know that Nasty Gal do really, really fast shipping. And I know that if you guys do order over the weekend, it will definitely come in time for Splendor. So I've got you sorted. I've got you some inspo. Let's get into it. So the first item I wanted to show you guys is the one I'm wearing because this is my favorite one out of the whole thing and it's just so me. So I've got this cute little bustier by Nasty Gal and it sort of does it up through the middle kind of like a bra. So it's really flattering and then it's got the string down the back and you can tie it any way you like really. I've just done a cute little bow and then I've just paired it with these cute little black leather look festival chaps. I think they fit me so nice as well. So I love these. Okay, now the next item I got is this mesh dress with fire down the bottom. It is so me. And it also comes with a little black slit underneath, which you can take out if you like, but I think I would wear it with it and I think it would look so, so cute with cowboy boots. So I'm going to show you guys how I've styled this bad boy in the next snap. By the way guys, I also think that wearing like an orange winged liner would look so epic with this. on their own with a cute little bralette and like a big oversized jacket and then some high boots. That's how I personally would probably style them if I was wearing them on their own. But I also think that they'd look really cute underneath something like something mesh or something like that. So I'm gonna show you guys how I've styled these little cute knickers in the next snack. Okay guys, the next thing I got is this dress. Oh my God, I am honestly in love. So it's like a snake print sort of look again, but it's actually sequined, as you can tell. It's so beautiful and it's also slightly see-through. So I think it would look really cute, for example, with the snake print knickers that I just showed you, or even like a black leotard underneath and some cowboy boots. You could really dress this up or dress this down so easily, especially with a pair of heels or sandals. So I am in love with this. Denim shoes. 
shorts. I just love how oversized they are. Like I literally live in denim shorts in summer and I think that denim shorts are so good for festivals because they look really cool and casual but they're so easy to dress up, especially cute little ones like this with frayed little frills down the bottom. So I'm really excited to style these, these ones for you guys. Okay, now this I am in love with. It looked so insane on the model online, so I'm really excited to show you guys this piece on, but basically it's like a ribbed black long sleeve crop, but it's got like a corset shape down the bottom, so I'm really, really excited to style this for you guys. And this is another piece that is like so timeless, so I can, it can be dressed up or down so easily, or it could be dressed like festival look sort of thing. So yeah, I think this is gonna be really, really fun for me to style. Nobody knows, trying to hide but it shows Lost my sense of logical Think that I'm gonna explode Echoes inside of my bones Okay guys, the next little piece I got is this cute little bandeau crop top. So pretty much it's gonna be worn like that, but I just think it is so cute for a festival and I think it would look absolutely insane with a little matching bandana or something like that. I think you could get bandanas in something to match this so easily, so that would be really cute. And I also think if you're wearing this to a festival, it could be epic to like clip your own chains onto the metal part and have them dangling sort of thing. So that's a cute little idea for you guys. Some Splendor inspo, but I'm gonna show you guys how I styled this bad boy in the next snap. this suit jacket. Now, everyone knows suit jackets are like the biggest trend right now, so I had to get one, obviously. And I also think that suit jackets could be dressed up or down so well for festivals, especially Splendor, because Splendor, my friend, is cold. So something like this would honestly be perfect with like cute little hot pants underneath and a matching top and then some really high boots or anything like that would look so epic. Even a cute little slip dress and some cowboy boots and then a cowboy hat. with this so this is like a netted diamante dress but I think that this could be dressed up for a festival so so easily and I think it's just so beautiful like imagine getting your makeup done for a festival with this dress and being able to match your makeup to this I would honestly just put diamonds all over my eyeballs I'm not even kidding it is so stunning so I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like on in the next step. <laughs> taking myself to Splendor with. So this is like a white pleather jacket and I just really love the oversized fit. I think it's beautiful and one of my outfits is white so it's gonna be perfect. I cannot wait. So I'm gonna show you guys how I would style this in the next snap but you guys will also see how I've styled it for Splendor. So last piece of clothing from this haul is this beautiful dress. For some reason, I go through weird obsessions, all right? And right now, the obsession is corsets. 
Corsets, anything corset, on a dress, on a top, on a jumper, on a sleeve, throw it at me, I'll wear it. I'm actually obsessed with corset looking things at the moment. So that's why I picked this dress and I think that this could be dressed up again so easily. I think I've said that in every single slide, but this could be made to look really festival-like so easily. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do that in the next snap. my haul i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you got some major festival inspo for splendor or whatever festivals you have coming up i know that we're all so excited for listening out perth here in wa so get that inspiration going guys and go have a look on nasty gals website and don't forget to use my code emilyd55 because it gives you 55 percent off the entire site which is just while. Let me know if you want to see more of these videos guys and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please remember to subscribe to my channel because I just hit 30,000 subscribers and I am fucking stoked. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you.